Hey y'all, so I get asked all the time how I make my Instagram videos like this. How do I edit them? How do I add music? So I am just going to um, pretty much tell you exactly how I do this. All right, so the first thing I do, I always pull up my iMovie app. This app is only available for those who have a iPhone um or if you have a apple computer you can access imovie but yeah so what i'm going to do next i'm just going to select the video i already previously recorded and pretty much work with this video when you use the imovie it already zooms in so i just want to zoom out on the actual video I don't want it zoomed all the way in so that's what i'm doing right now and then i'm just dragging it to see what it looks like um having the video zoomed out and then secondly i just want to add music over my video i do understand a lot of you don't know how to add music so i'm going to show you all i do i go to um i go to youtube and while I'm on YouTube, I just search up an instrumental of any popular song. Um, I am going to search the City Girls, <laughs> City Girls Act Up Instrumental. Um, and then all I'm going to do is click on one of the instrumentals and I'm going to make sure I screen record it. You have the option to screen record with a iPhone. So I pretty much screen record it. Um, however long the however long i want the music to be playing i will screen record it up to that time for the most part i will say when it comes to using instrumentals um when it comes to using music that you're screen recording on youtube you always run the chance of a copyright issue and if the music is copyrighted instagram will will remove the um posts that you created so you want to be careful with that um, and pretty much to add the song to your video you want to go to the videos click on the screen recording and you're going to click on the music option and then it's just going to add the music to your video Right, as you can see, the blue part is where the audio was added from the screen recording that we made. I am going to duplicate my video. That way my video is long enough to last to where the beat actually drops. Because, you know, I want the beat to actually drop in my video. So, <laughs> so once I'm done doing that, I am going to... Um, pretty much crop off the music and delete like that back portion and i'm gonna save this and then i'm gonna open this up open up this video in photo grid Alright, so once I open up Photo Grid, I'm going to click the edit option and I'm going to click on the video that I just made. What I want to do, I want to crop out the black part of the video. I just, in Window, I'm not Window, but in iMovie, I just hate that they have that black background. So I want to get rid of it. So I just crop it out and I hit save. And then after the video is saved, I am going to go back to the main screen in Photo Grid and I am going to click on Grid, click on the video that I just saved, and then I'm going to change the background to white. Yes, you guys, I just like a nice white background. <laughs> so now I want to add... Um, now I want to add my logo to the videos. My logos are already transparent. So I'm adding this logo, my Everything Ebony logo. And then I'm going to go back and add in my Wigs by Ebony logo. And I pretty much added those by selecting the option at the bottom that says image. Because it allows you to add the image into a video or into a already um, or into a photo. And then I'm just going to click save and then I'm pretty much done editing my video. Um, I added music to it. I added my transparent logos and then I'm just going to upload it to Instagram.